Go home. <laughs> what are you still <laughs> doing you here? Doing? What are you doing here? Go buy some of this. This yes, dude, because uh, yeah, good nineteen twenty. No, this. If you can't find that, like, really? I feel bad. Yeah, there's, there's like, what, what if they don't they, they don't sell this for other states from other warehouses and other floors? It'll be other barrels, and they will taste slightly different. Okay, we'll go buy a bottle of this from a different warehouse on a different floor and send it to us, and we'll see yes. if it's the same or not. Yeah, yeah, to, 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 and we, we will be the judge. We will compare it side by side, just like this. <laughs> it's been a long week. Has it? It's Friday. It's the end of the week. You're supposed to party it up. and then That's what we're doing, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's what we're trying to do. You're trying to fall asleep on it. We do have to show off camera. Yeah, <laughs> all right. And uh, welcome back to Whiskey Buds. I'm Kurt. And I'm Billy. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the same every time. It's like, yeah, I'm Billy. I'm Billy. So I had, to, I had to mix it up. I don't think that one was a good mix up. <laughs> you sounded like you were trying to seduce someone over there. Yeah. Like in the you. camera. You know, you know, he's actually looking at himself in the camera. Little screen on the camera. <laughs> we got to <laughs> All right. Old Forester. Yes, Old hey, Forester. No. I like Old Forester. You have tried Old Forester 1920. But. Yeah, that stuff was good. It was one of my favorites. It was. It's Way actually back one of in my the old favorites. days, looking at our, our yeah. list that we don't keep up to date anymore. <laughs> it's, there's not enough. Like, this is not a note taking show. Yeah. <laughs> So this is one of their single barrels, right? So this is like, each one would taste a little different. Okay, um, it looks pretty dark. Yeah, I don't know. Like, in this case, this is if you if we can't actually see it on there, maybe we can zoom in. Um, this is barrel for Wyoming. Basically, Wyoming picked it out. You know, whoever does it. Selected for Wyoming. Yeah. Warehouse J, floor six. That's where the barrel was so stored. So it doesn't sound like Wyoming's the most important for them. What do you mean? Floor six, warehouse J. Now that could be the best juice right there. I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? Like, like where where it has it is at in the warehouse and what warehouse? Right. Like that makes that me dictates. question too. Like how many warehouses do they have and how many floors do they have? Oh, they dude, they have like twenty floors per warehouse, man. They must have a lot of whiskeys. It's like they go to like floor Z. Oh, they said floor six, huh? I don't know. Look at the bubbles. Yeah. Oh, what are He's... we doing here? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody might have had a drink earlier. It's a weird week. You hear that? I do. The gurgling. That's kind of a lot. Well, I'll fix it on mine. Hopefully it's good. We're going to find out. So, most likely somebody from Wyoming is like a representative of the... They should pick us. <laughs> They, they should. Like, they we'll should send pick, us. We'll pick the whiskey for a while. Yeah. We'll, we'll pick out the barrel. Um, who would we want to pick a barrel from? A single barrel? Old Forester? I mean, they, that's good stuff from 1920. <laughs> Their 1920 um, blend. Pro prohibition. Yeah. Pre prohibition style. Um, who else would we want to pick a barrel from? I'm trying to read the list. I don't know. Four Roses, but he didn't like Four Roses. No, that stuff's not good. What's the last one we had with the, that was good? That one. Which one? The, the McAllen? One? No, the, the other one that's like McAllen. Oh, uh, you're thinking Abelur. Yeah. Yeah, they should fly us out to Scotland. Oh, dude, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll pick one. Yeah, we will We will pick <laughs> a Selected good barrel, for Wyoming. too. Wyoming. Yeah, we're, we're willing to try as many as they'll let us. <laughs> and we'll pick the best one for Wyoming. As long as it takes. Yeah. Yeah, we're willing. We're, we're committed. <laughs> I wouldn't last very long. <laughs> <laughs> no. Especially trying the barrels when they're they're barrel proof and stuff. Oh, man. Or I'd get through all of them and be like, nope, none of them are good. Yeah, I don't like any of them. <laughs> Give me your usual 12-year-old stuff. <laughs> oh, let's get back to the show. What are, Old Forester. So Old Forester. Is... Yeah, so this is a single barrel. So this somebody picked it. Uh, they have actually changed it. This is a... Um, a bottling that they did at 90 proof, but now they do their single barrels at 100 proof. This is 90 proof. Oh, yeah. so you're saying they're, they're 100 Yeah, they now. have changed it now, yeah. So this doesn't have a year on it? Nope. So 
How old no, is this, it? We don't know. Not age statement. It's, so when you do a barrel picking, like you go to the, the distillery or like last year, and this, this probably would have been picked when they went to the distillery, but somebody would go or they would send you samples and then you would pick which one is best and then you would buy the barrel. And then they would bottle the barrel and that's it. Well, you can buy a barrel? Yeah. It's rather expensive, but yeah. That'd be cool. And then they'll bottle it for you, like this one, right? So we could have whiskey buds, you know, single barrel. Ooh. Well, let's try this. Yeah. What do you think? Ooh. That's some... That's some nose flavors going on there. <laughs> the nose flavors, that's it, yeah. It smells good. It does smell good. It doesn't, it's not nearly as strong as that 1920. It's been a while since I've had it, but... Do yeah. we need do we need to try it? Do a side by side? No. Let's give this one all our love. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. It smells good though. What are you What are you getting on this? Are you getting any caramel? Any vanilla? <clears throat> Those are usually really dominant in bourbons and stuff. Yeah. Caramel. No, I don't smell any vanilla, but. Maybe not really, kind of caramel, but definitely the sugar. Yeah, there's sweet. there's a sweetness there. Uh, I always consider it the corn sweetness. Definitely does smell sweet, but not not too sweet. Not not as bad as some of those that I've I've seen. Or not as much. It's got a nice oily residue. It is, and it, it's <laughs> it's a pretty dark color too. Yeah, it is. Sweet on the flavor. Some bold flavors. Yeah. That's pretty good. You like that? Yeah. Huh. So maybe you just like Old Forester? So far. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think this is, this is only the second Old Forester we've had on here, so... Mm -hmm. What are you getting on the flavors? Like any any caramel, any vanilla on the flavors? I mean, I'm definitely getting a sweetness, but I'm not Man, sure what kind tastes, of sweetness it is. It tastes high quality. Does it? Yeah. All right. It's not real complex. No. I mean, there's not a lot of like overlapping flavors, like so, compared to the scotches we had like last week. The last couple of weeks we've had scotches that have so many more like intricate flavors. Yeah, it's definitely stronger. Like the, I can t I can tell it's nine, the ninety proof mm -hmm. that it makes a difference. But it's good. The bourbon itself is so much more potent too. Using the new oak barrels, it really draws a lot of the stronger flavors out. And it, it tends to be more bold. How much is this? Uh, I paid like forty forty five dollars for it. That but might be, that might be a good deal because this is. That's that's my. My summary of this is high quality. All right. Like it just. Yeah. Yeah. I bought two bottles of it too. Because when when they barrel it, there's only like between 250 and 300 bottles that'll come out of a barrel. Hmm. Which means 250 to 300 of these, and that's it. Like done. So two of them are here. One that you're trying, and one is still sitting upstairs. Okay. So it doesn't have it. It's um. It's not real. It's uh, it's got a little spice. Okay. With whether it be alcohol or whatever, like mm -hmm. just a tiny bit, like it yep. the, from last episode, the the tongue pincher. The tongue pincher. <laughs> all right. Yeah. <laughs> so just a tiny bit, not bad at all. And then right away, there's a hint of sweetness. You know, like the 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 Crown Royal has that real sweet sugar. Yes. So it it feels like it, it it seems like it has a little bit of that in mm -hmm. it. Yep. But it doesn't seem as, as cheap. As, yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I call it high quality because like go. it yeah. tastes like some like real high quality burnt sugar. <laughs> <laughs> it's not quite burnt sugar, but burnt. it is it's it is like, that sweetness. It's like it's just, I don't know. It's good. All right. Well, I think I think 
Billy just likes Old Forester. How could you not? It's good. <laughs> it is. Like, between their 1920 and this, like, I'm sold. You know, yeah, what, what is good. interesting, though, is kind of like our, um, oh, what was that one? Lafroig? Yeah. That one stays on your palate for a long time. Mm hmm. Where this doesn't. I'm. It, like, clears out pretty quickly. I, I guess you're right. I'm still getting, like, like yeah, some sort of, bit, of like, something there. Yeah, but. But it's not, like, a lot of flavor, though, right? No. It's more it? like a numbing sensation, honestly. Yeah. It feels like you need to refresh more often. Yes. <laughs> to get, you know, it tastes good, so you're like, oh, give me yeah, a I'll just take another sip. I'll just take another sip. Yeah. So As you notice when he said I poured a little much, and it's almost gone. Yeah, that's all I want to do is just, like, it's good, but it, yeah, yeah, it's just gone. wants so. to keep getting a little bit of a refresh. So, yeah, the finish is not as long as a lot of these others. It's good. But it tastes good. Yeah, yeah just it just disappears quickly because it doesn't, I don't know. It's good though, I like it. Yeah. All right, cool. Um, yeah, I don't think there's any reason to linger on it. Um, chances are this is not gonna be something that most people can find even if they do live in Wyoming because it was bought a year ago, something like that. Yeah, that's good, it's got a good flavor. Yeah. I can't think of one I like better than this other than some of the, I, I do like the smoky. Yeah. But all in all, like, where did where would this compare for you for that 1920, based on your memory? Because I mean, we could pour you one, but I don't remember now. Because I remember that being good, but now like now this seems better. Okay. <laughs> well, do we want to pause for a quick second, and I can I can get you a quick yeah, small pour of 1920. Let's do it. Hmm. I hope he pauses this video instead of just letting it play with me standing here for five minutes, talking to myself, drinking whiskey. <laughs> okay, we're back. And he got <laughs> All right, I guess Old we're Forester back. Hunter Proof. What is this? It's just straight up Old Forester, just the regular stuff. Like this? Um, the higher proof? Kind of. It's just the hundred proof, like Old Forester, just the usual stuff. Like this is like twenty five dollars. Huh. <laughs> good, 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 good. Yeah. <laughs> We're just giving ourselves a nice little sampling there. All right, now. Boy, this show is going off the rails. I tell you what. You know okay. who's going to be going off the rails. Yeah. This is not weak K stuff. <clears throat> so not this one yet. This is this is the ninety. This is the okay. Uh, 19, That's the nineteen twenty. Nineteen twenty. Yep. Well, nineteen twenty is one hundred fifteen proof. Yes. I forgot about that. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oh wait a minute. Hey, thumb, thumb, thumbs up. <laughs> Everything's good. Thumb We're upping. not going to have another Jetta engine episode. Thumb upping yourself. It is. Like, okay. that's exactly right. Like, all right. Just. Wow. Like, the scents are so similar. No. No? This one's dust. This is a clean glass. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got a dusty mouth. <laughs> So that was your saying. That one smells dusty, thankfully. Oh, woo! I just burnt my nose here. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to get a better whiff, and woo, yeah. I did. All right. Yeah, that one smells a little. That's, that's definitely smells so sweeter. A little dusty. <laughs> I think it's I, the glass. I get it. Though. <laughs> it's, not, it's not the I, glass. I, no, I don't. I don't think so. Oh, I don't. I don't get that sweet scent to it. <laughs> No, this the, the the single barrel is definitely a little sweeter in scent. Okay, um, here we go. This is 1920. 1920. Holy cow! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Somebody turned the dial of the volume or the yeah the they volume cranked the, it up on us of the taste up. Oh man, that's uh. 
That's good. <laughs> it's not bad, is it? But man, it's it's potent. Mm -hmm. You know it's high proof, but it's, it tastes good. That's why I was one I didn't of your even favorites. Taste much there. Okay, let me try it again. It's strong. It is. Ooh. What do you think? <laughs> I don't know, man. This. <laughs> the single barrel tastes so mellow. Oh, somebody hold me up. This <laughs> one, I think, is better. Okay. You like that? The, the Wyoming edition of Old Forester better than 1920, huh? What? Just by, like, this much. That stuff is strong. It is. I don't remember it being that strong. Well, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> well, <laughs> they're both good, though. They, they really are. They really are. I mean, all we're both. battling against is the alcohol content on this, but they both taste good. Uh, and both they're got good, bold flavors. Like, and I swear the, the, the Wyoming edition single barrel is sweeter. I think it is. Yeah. Than the 1920. Um, I'd say it is. And, and that's about the only thing I can pick out in the sense. Taste, on the other hand, like the, the, the flavor of the 1920 is just really turned up. And, uh, the 90 feels like like very subtle and muted at that point, but still like really good. It's like the flavors just aren't as bold. But they're very similar flavors. Yeah. I mean, this one, looking at these, this one almost looks darker. Yeah, it does. Yeah, I'm going to have to say this one's the better one. Mm. All right, well, finish off a little bit of one of those. And we'll give you a taste of this regular old Forester 100 proof. <laughs> this, this show is... Yeah, well. I'm just going to make these for now. <laughs> I don't know how much more of this I can take. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> well, come on, 90 proof, 100 proof, 115 proof. I mean, come on, you came here to drink whiskey. We're feeding you whiskey, like... You should be pretty damn happy about all this. How come I poured so much? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I've been drinking whiskey too. Hmm. This <laughs> kind of funny because okay. it almost seems like this is in the middle of the other two. Can you Which believe that? Which by proof it is. Yeah. <laughs> I am not getting the sweetness on this. On the like, I'm getting a little sweetness, but it it. it Feels toned down even over this the ninety proof. I think it smells sweeter than this one, but not as sweet as this one. So okay, that's like in the middle mm. again. I don't even know if I can smell anything anymore, dude. Like I feel like I'm getting that to that point too. Like <laughs> I don't know, maybe maybe that's just not good for and us to try three whiskeys like hard. this. Yeah. After you hit that hundred and fifteen proof, like everything just kind of seems mellow after that. Okay, let's taste it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm down. It's okay. Like, it's mm. good, but not... There's there's more burn there. There's less sweetness. I don't know. Maybe there's more sweetness, but... I don't even know what's going on. There's like a bitterness at the end of it. Are you catching that? I'm super confused. I thought it was sweet, then I thought it wasn't sweet, and then I'm like trying to listen to your notes about it, and I'm like, is All right. It right? No. Yes. No. <laughs> yeah. What? Yeah. I, th I think I think we're in agreement on that. All right. <laughs> <laughs> um, I am finding it difficult which one to prefer over the 1920 versus the single barrel. The Old Forester 100 proof. Um, for the money for like like I said 25 bucks and it's easy to find mm -hmm. usually that one might be alright but after having these two I think this one's outclassed yeah it really is like it's 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 a good bourbon but not it's not in the same realm as these two it really isn't 
It's just, I don't know. There's something. I think this one's a little bit. I like this one better. I think it's a little easier to drink. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This one is just more potent for if that's what you're feeling. Yeah. This one's like, turn a, turn a dial, dial up. I keep saying it, but. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, is this episode over yet? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. Um, I'm going to go I've... to the 1920 to end out this episode because that's these, like these ones are taking me out dude yeah I, I know you guys probably can't get the wyoming version but the 1920 by far if you can't like go go out and find it and try it yeah the 1920 is good it's so similar to this one it is Just, and you can add some water to it to tone it down um we would do that for billy but that would be treating him too nicely for this show talk to <laughs> don't do that don't do that like just eat it just, just drink, just drink it. it just as it is so all right you yeah don't, so don't eat whiskey eat whiskey you don't eat it some of this stuff is thick enough you feel like you can <laughs> it's not even thick it just tastes thick like all right this was a good test we might have to do a blind test of this later oh that would be fun all right uh tune in next week Next two weeks, next, I don't know. We're, we're, we're going to do these three as a blind tasting. That's for sure. That would be interesting. Cool. Um, I don't <laughs> know when we're going to make that happen because we got a few other things. But yeah. So join us for that and then uh, watch us otherwise. Um, I don't care. <laughs> when you drink enough whiskey, you, care you just about don't anything care. Anymore? <laughs> <laughs> uh, my glass. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, Have a cheers, one, everyone. Folks. That should probably be the last one. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, we did it up for the last one. We're good. <laughs> oh, boy. Just wait till we go ahead and just do this for one episode. You know what we should do? We should blind taste that before we taste it. Okay. What do you think? I'm going to get down, right? Like... We'll have Isabella like, form for us. We've never tasted these. Mm -hmm. Let's see if we can like guess which ones are which. To go through and we'll pick out first, second, and third, right? So do no. a complete blind tasting. We'll just like by looking at the bottles and tasting them, like which one do you think? We think it is, yeah. and then we will also rank them, you know, Ooh, best to worst. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I like it. Dude, all right. Like, write um, that down. Oh, that's we're, what we're still doing. on. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. I thought all we were right. already into this episode. We did? <laughs> uh, this is all just going to be outtakes. I don't know. Like, it's it's still recording for some reason. Which one is this? Uh, one taste and you will know. I told you. Woo. You would know. Yeah. <laughs> just pick one and go with it. Just live with your decision. Yeah. Well, I'm done.